What is going on everybody? How is it going? Hope you're having a great day. Hey, it's finally sunny out. That doesn't mean much today. It's still a little chilly, but it's warm. I mean, you know, it's warmer. Anyway, brought the boss with me. What are you doing in there? Well, I'm looking pretty in my parka. <laughs> Your parka? That's a winter coat. Yeah, it's just a winter coat. <laughs> oh. Oh, I'll tell you what. Yeah, she's supervising today. Guys, we did uh, that house there, the house down there, the one, two doors down. This is a new one on the route just for the next two weeks while they're on vacation. And then we're doing this one. It is uh, lots of trimming, lots of walking, lots of work. Uh, Justin is out doing a... 17 yard mulch job we are going to go there before the day's over and show you that one but i got to get to work i've got uh six left out of the 16 and uh i gotta move so let's go Okay, that one is done. Got her all done, I showed it to you. But, uh, man, this grass is really, really fine. And uh, it's really awesome, I love it. But uh, a lot of bumps, like high spots. So I'm gonna get the side here for you in this front. And uh, that yard is so cut up. It just takes too much time to record the whole thing. So let's get that one done. I'll see you in a minute and uh, we'll get over to that mulch job. So let's go. <laughs> Alright guys, I got uh, this small yard here done, a little small front, small back, a little bit on the side here, that back there, that is it for the day, so we're going to head over and look at that mulch job, and I'm going to say that he's probably got 10 yards out of the 17 done already, I just know him in uh four hours yeah he's probably kicked butt so let's go check it out help him out a little bit get some footage it's a monster man 17 yards and uh i think he'll be home by 6 30 so i'm gonna go help him for about an hour let's go all right guys so here is the massive pile of mulch Boom, boom, boom. Look at that. And he's got a third of it done already. So this is what it looks like. What's up, Mulch Queen? I, I'm here to help. Are you? All right. For at least an hour, and then I'm going to cut grass. Okay. What do you think, dude? <laughs> Trying to knock it out. Here, I'll show you what I've got done. All right. Um, 
walk us, take off. Okay. Show you where I started. This was the third area that I got right here. Third area. Third area. That's a massive bed, guys. Yeah, area three. Area. Th area three. Area three. All right, so here is area two. And I stopped right here because the mulch piles here, I'll just get right. it's so close. Yeah. You got all this done. We're kind of going backwards. No, I, I like it. Guys, this is a massive mulch job. <laughs> He's going to be here till 8.30 tonight. I can see it. Yep, oh, I got to get uh, right there. All this. Wow. Um, recently, I've started to get up on the porch area, so I got... Oh, let there. me take him up there. Okay. So oh. he got that bed done back there. Yeah, that was That's a mass. How many did, did that... How many did it take? I lost count after about 100. <laughs> Yeah, it takes a it takes a massive amount. This needs done right here. Yeah. So this is all done. Well, up to there. Yeah, that's where I left off at. And uh, this was the kind of most recent that I finished uh, right here. I get inside there. Um, I got behind those couches. I got there. Yep. He got all that back there. I got to the right. Guys, this is one massive mulch job <laughs> so you got a little bit to put in here still yeah all right sure so we're gonna get working where's the best place for you to bring me dumps um i am going right here i'm going this way all right. so all right let's go back to work so guys what i'm gonna do is show you how i lay mulch everybody's different um, he got the edging done yesterday which looks really good Actually, let me show you the edging. And I love the edging shovel. I will never use anything but you can see the cut on that. All the way to there and down. Just a phenomenal cut. And you do not want to fill that up. You just want the mulch to go into that edge. So... As soon as he gets back here, we'll go to town and I'll kind of explain what I do. Well, I can explain it now. I always go to the farthest point away from me. So we're going to go right up against those bushes and I'll hand place it up underneath there. Get me right up there in between and you'll see where he puts it. And then I'll get up there and put that up there and He's going to put some over there, so let me get to it. for my mulch jobs and this is why hand edging and hand placement and hand smoothing and I think it looks great and uh, when this is all over he'll have some pictures I'll post them on Instagram and I always take my mulch and drag it down towards the edge this weekend again that way you can see one from start to finish so let me 
show you how that looks now down in that edge. It took me about two years to teach Justin how I wanted it done, but I do happen to think I'm very good at mulch. That is my one specialty. Been doing it a long time. So many found so many different ways to do it and little tricks and stuff like that every Sunday I'm going to be doing a video about mulching we're going to do some big jobs some smaller jobs but uh, you want to take that hill right there and you want to leave your one and a half two inches and just pull from it and pull it out and push it so and then when you mulch an area like this, you're just going to kind of take it in your hands and feather it over there. And I'll show you that here in a minute. So guys, what I do is I'm not trying to get two inches here. I'm trying to just get it in between all these little nooks and crannies. A lot of you may do this already. And... Undoubtedly, a lot of you are going to tell me I'm full of crap, but I don't care because I know my mulch jobs. And uh, I told them it took about two years for me to teach you all this stuff to get it really good. Would you say? Yeah. have to go back in with your hands and brush out your flowers or your plants pull out your weeds you, you know somebody knows what weeds are <laughs> <laughs> I heard you know a guy but that doesn't know what weeds are <laughs> he does but he does shoddy work <laughs> around show them what it looks like now with one wheelbarrow of mulch in it and you don't have to get down and do this by hand and that's covered and then we'll just go around and get all the outlying stuff guys so let me show you this corner a little bit better that's what it's going to look like we're uh, finishing this little area right here into those stones you can see now this bed back here is a monster I'm telling you it really is a huge bed it doesn't look like it but it goes way back all right guys there it is the entire area right there and that's where we stopped we got one dump back in the back justin's gonna start putting dumps out and uh i'm gonna get this grass cut what do you think man it's a job <laughs> it is a job are you worn out not yet. Tell them uh, what's the key to doing mulch fast. Dump for a while, spread for a while. Dump for a while, spread for a while. Repeat, rinse, and uh, you're good to go. <laughs> and you think we have enough to do the whole front? Yes. Okay. Yes. Well, 
I'm going to spread this out for him real quick, and uh, then I'm going to mow. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this one. I'll show you the front yard. I don't. I think you've seen it. This is where we took the trees down. But there's some uh, area back in here that needs mulch. This little area right here. And that over there. And it is done. And uh, put these two bushes in right here. The same ones we took out. I don't know if you guys can believe this. 250 bucks a piece for those bushes. Whew. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember, get out here, bid these mulch jobs. If you need help, give me a call. Uh, text me, Instagram me at DLT Lawn Care. I'll help you guys out. Um, I do not mind at all. And uh, you can make some excellent... This one, we'll talk about uh, t in tomorrow's video. But, uh, whew, yeah, this one's a good one. So... As always, Dr. Real was in the house. Keep it real. Be good to people. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Peace.